Okay, now for the moment you've all been waiting for, how to balance multiple sessions, one after the other. So let's say in the daytime you do several analyses, one after the other, and then when you're ready to go home you can set up the balancing uh, for all of them at once and it'll do one after the other. To do that, go up to balancing and run session and then run multiple sessions. Up comes your multi-balance session window. You choose from your client list the first one that you want to balance. I'm going to choose this test for July, the dry eyes one. And we need to set up the balancing time for each tuning. Now I'm going to set them all just to one because I want you to be able to see how it switches from one session to the next to the next. But normally you want to have, uh, you want to douse for that and find out exactly how many seconds for the delay for the balancing time and the number of cycles. The interval time should be at least 10 seconds, but again you should douse for it. I'm going to set mine to 10 seconds, but generally it needs to be at least 10 seconds between each client just to clear the energy field. And it may be more, so it's best to douse for it. So add that to the to the session manager here. And then we're going to do George next. So I click on George's session. And I'm just going to set his all at one as well so you can go on so we can go on to the third one and then I'll measure them for the last one. So I add him to the the group of sessions that are going to be balanced. And then the third one will be Don's test number two program. So this one I'm actually going to measure each one of the balancing times. So I get four seconds for the balancing time and the delay between each one of the tunings. I just get one second for that. And the number of cycles would need to be five times, six times. So uh, the interval between the two sessions doesn't really matter on the last one because it's just going to turn off anyway. So we're going to click on Add and now we're ready to run those sessions. So I put my SE5 in balance at 50 percent, switch into the balance mode. Now normally you're going to have sessions that have both positive and negative tunings in them, so most of the time you'll be wanting to set your SE5 on balance at 50 percent. If you have only positive tunings in the sessions that you've made for all of those people, then you can run it at 100 percent. If you have only negative tunings in there for all of them, of course you could then run them at zero percent. So there is a way to do that. But generally speaking, you're going to be running everything at 50 percent. So I've set my SE5 at 50 percent and then I click on start. And now it starts the first video as well as balancing each one of those tunings. And when it gets to the end, then it's going to pause for six, uh, for ten seconds and then it'll switch to the next person. Okay, so now it's going to take a 10 second pause. And now it's going to begin balancing George. And his is balancing the root chakra. Along with all the different tunings. And when that's finished, now it's going to wait for 10 more seconds before it balances the last person. I only have three people in my, in my session list, but you could have even 10 people. And now it's going to begin balancing then those last tunings for Don again. And he's doing the heart chakra with the heart chakra video, along with all the different tunings here, the metals, whatever comes up. And then it will stop. 